Hello. Today I thought I would talk about Logo Maker. Oops, Logo Maker AI. So this is a great tool that actually recently got bought by Namecheap. Um, so it works a little differently than it used to, but um, basically it's free and a great tool for um, conceptualizing your logos before you're ready to buy one or pay someone to um, maybe take an idea and flesh it out. Right? Um, if you're if you're trying to use Canva or Corel Draw or something else to devise a logo, it's, you, you've got to kind of come up with the whole concept yourself. And people will pay uh, professionals to come up with a logo design and ask you about how you feel, the, the fonts, your style, and all that kind of stuff. But this app, actually, this website, does a really good job of doing that for you. So I thought I'd just step you through how this works. So you go to logomaker.ai, which actually takes you to this name cheap thing, and then um, you put in your brand's name. So say I was going to do a logo for uh, Rockstar Bingo. Now, our platform already has one, but uh, let's just say I didn't have one already. So what it's doing is it's going to ask uh, six questions about your fonts and style, and then it's going to ask about your color palette based on the feel you're trying to do, and then um, ask you for some icons to use. And again, um, even if you don't love the logos that are produced at the end, it gives you dozens if not hundreds of choices afterwards that you can tweak. Um, at the very least, it allows you to get the concept out, maybe um, share it with others and get feedback. Um, it's a real time saver. So um, first off, you can choose a style. So Rockstar Bingo is a platform for providing music bingo to hosts everywhere. And, um, you know, we're trust we're, we are trend, traditional and trustworthy. We are versatile, but I think we're friendly and playful mostly. So I'm going to actually choose that. Uh, then it's asking about serious or fresh. I think we're uh, youthful and cheerful. Yeah, I'll go with that. And then um, thin or thick. Well, uh, I want it to stand out. We want it to be energetic, I think. So I'll go with that. And then playful or, or elegant. Uh, so again, these words at the bottom tend to help. Um, I think uh, I think I'm going to go with friendly, uh, and then organic or geometric. So again, eh, too much, too stylistic. Yeah, I kind of like that one. And and don't worry, you're not committing to all these things either. These are just to provide background and feedback for the logo until you're ready. And then uh, funky or normal. Uh, I'm going to go with uh, funky. Yep. And I know that, uh, at least with Rockstar Bingo, our main color palette is purple. But sometimes you want to look at this and go, well, you know, this is for uh, a design company. And we want to be cheerful and vibrant or uh, earthy. But in this case, I'm going to go with bold, engaging. You can also then add a slogan, which they would incorporate if you want. Um, so let's, uh, let's go with put bums in seats and keep them there. That's what Rockstar Bingo does for bars and pubs and events. And the last one is you can pick three favorite icons. Now again, this is just to get started. You might still take this to a, an artist and say, okay, I want you to take this concept and grow on it or change these logos or you're gonna go in and add some something else. But you know, in the meantime, um, let's just go with guitar because this is a tool about you know rock music and stuff. I like, uh, well, that one's pretty good. And then let's do uh, bingo because <laughs> I think I've done this before and I think bingo's in there, yeah. Well, I don't love these. Let's just go with uh, that one. And then, uh, you know, music is definitely involved too. So let's go with, for sake of speed, ooh, a triplet, perfect. So you can see it's continue with three icons. And so now it's gonna actually give me um, a whole bunch of ready to go logos that could at least get the conversation started, or maybe you'll love it. And certainly when you hover over, you can download, share it, They'll happily charge you nine bucks to own the logo um, if you really want to just pay them for it. Um, uh, I think they'll offer to put in business cards and, and uh, stationery for you. But like, I use this as a concept finder. So, you know, let's just keep going. I'll just pick one for now that stands out. That's actually not, well, no, I actually don't love the font. But note that you can actually use this tool afterwards to even refine it further before you take and run with it. So maybe I'll just look a bit more. You can see this just, if I just keep scrolling, it just keeps offering options because it's actually using AI, artificial intelligence and machine learning to basically come up with all these concepts for you. So down a go, down a go, down a go, down a go. Uh, you know what? I should just go with my gut, which always, <laughs> and really one of the ones at the top here stood out, at least for now. Yeah, I'm gonna go with that one. Don't love everything about it, but let's click that. And you can see now that I'm in here, I can actually still change the color scheme. So if I don't love that, I could go, oh, let's do that. Or, oh, yeah, that pops, perfect. And then, um, okay, so I've got my color scheme. What am I doing? Right, oh yeah, break out of color. 
And then the text, if I don't love that font, I can still dig into the other fonts it offered based on my styling. So I'm going to actually change it to that one. Ooh, that's looking pretty good. Um, the slogan, it's a bit small. Now, of course, I've got a lot of text in that slogan, so that's probably part of my problem. But let's go with that. And uh, I think I still like the, I, the guitar, but I could actually choose something entirely different, right? You can see I can put that in there. And then the layout uh, is like where the icon sits. So, right, the guitar could sit on top. Let's go with that. Perfect. So, uh, and this is where I might just use Snagit um, or just screen capture, but I could just go, you know what? There's my logo. And I'll just capture that. And I'll just drag that over here. And, right, I can just send this to someone as an email and say, hey, what do you think of this? And uh, at least get the concept going. So, uh, that's Logo Maker in a nutshell. Um, great little tool for at least conceptualizing logos, um, creating logos, or, um, you know what, uh, just uh, maybe it's the final logo. Maybe you're just like, you know what, that's it. Let's get going. Um, hope this helps someone.